Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up a web mapping framework to host your spatial data and use that hosted data to develop a WebGIS application. For this purpose, we will use open source softwares. The main software which we are going to use is GeoServer, which is a WebGIS server very popular in open source domain. To install GeoServer, the main requirement is Java Runtime version 8. Any version greater than 8 is not supported at the moment. And there's great documentation available for GeoServer in this particular link. The first step is to download the required Java runtime environment software from this link and you can select this particular file. I have already downloaded this exe file and installed it in my machine. You will need a login to download uh, this particular software from Oracle. The next step is to download the required GeoServer release, the stable version of GeoServer, which is 2.17.2 currently. And you can go to this particular link and download the platform independent binary. I have also done uh, downloading the GeoServer uh, version, which is a zip file and let's see how to install GeoServer in this machine now. So here you can see this is the downloaded GeoServer uh, platform independent binary. At first I will extract uh, this zip file into a folder and I will copy this folder into C drive where my GeoServer is going to be in my machine. I will rename this folder into just GeoServer. And inside this Geo folder, you can see all the uh, subfolders required for GeoServer to function. There's no other particular installation required for GeoServer. The only step remained is to set required environment variables. So we have to set uh, three environment variables, two for GeoServer and one for Java. And let's set those environment variables. So you can search for environment. And in this UI, you can go to advanced. In the system variables, I will say new. I will type geoserver underscore home. I can copy this link and say OK. So geoserver underscore home is added. Now the next one is geoserver data there. And I can say new. Remove the space. Copy the path to the folder. Uh, you have to make sure that your path is uh, same or adapt to adapt this to your path in your machine. So that is also set. Now let's create an environment variable for Java Home. Java Home, and you will find this folder in program files. So I will set that link also and say OK. That's it for the GeoServer installation. So once you have installed JRE uh, and set all these environment variables, you are good to go. Now, how to start GeoServer? So to start GeoServer, you have to go to the GeoServer folder, go to bin, and double click on startup.bat. 
so it will check a lot of settings initialize the geo server and slowly start up we'll check all the ogc services available all the layers available and list all of them okay once you see this message started at a number ms milliseconds that means your geo server is already started it's ready to launch now how do you uh, see the geo server interface so to see the geo server interface you should use this particular url if it is installed in your machine but if it is installed in a um, in a server with a public ip this local host will be replaced with uh, your public ip by default geo server is will use uh, the port 8080 you can also change the settings and change the port if there is another service uh, is already using this particular port so let me go to a browser and say local host 8080 slash geo server Yes, so if your installation went well, you will see such an interface and it is installed in your local host. And the default username is admin and password is geo server. So you can use these credentials to log in. So you log in. And here you can see a lot of things you can uh, see how many layers are already there number of workspaces and all these layers are demo layers which uh, geo server provide uh, with the installation you can go to layer preview and uh, you see some of the layers uh, for example usa population is available here so you can use the open layers link to see uh, that particular yeah. So that's how you install your server in your local machine. Thank you.